all right so this is where we stopped uh let me quickly teach us two things that are very closed if not wet, well explained to you you may not get it right so we call them padding and margin padding and margin padding as in p-a-d-d-i-n-g then margin m-a-r-g-i-n so margin works with um space between border and around it space around the border line border right that is why i use this background color you see this background colored now so it's like when we put a block on on the tree that is the background image so now that is the block of form so now on form we can put margin when we put margin now you will see the difference see how this the edges of this form now see how it is close to the main background let's go to to our css and put margin there instead of spreading it again let me just pick it from here uh -huh. so this is margin and then let me use um let's say 100 100 pixel 100 pixel sit now let's save it and come back here to view it what did you notice so the the form the background of the form it means the form block has reduced a lot so the space can you see where i'm doing this aha the space between the main body and and the form itself is what we call margin. So let's go and reduce it so that it's going to be fine. So I intentionally use that. So let's use like 50 pixels. Let's see how it's going to be. Okay, so this is what we want. It's fine this way. Or oh. so now, because I didn't indicate something, so I just said margin. So it is affecting every area here. Can you see it? But if I just say margin top, let's I just indicate that margin top. So you're going to affect the top alone. This, then put top. Let's save it and go and view it. So you see, every other part remains the way they were before. So it affects only the top. But I actually want it to affect everything. So let's leave it as margin generally and then probably uh, let me extend the let me reduce this so that let me reduce it like 30 pixel. Okay, so it seems that I love it now. So with this now uh we can also talk about padding now padding has to do with the elements the content inside this form now the space between the element and the border let's see so padding let me choose 50 stupid zero and then save and let's go and view it wow okay so what i'm talking about so this is the uh this is the border of the form so padding will let the content the padding is the space between the border the element border and its content are you getting it now why margin is is the space between around the border itself so i want to reduce it so that the space will not be too much let me reduce this to like let me reduce this to like 20 percent 20 pixel rather save it and then come here to view it i'm using phone no? don't come and tell me it's not working on your it works on every phone okay so it's nice now it's beautiful so let's meet in the next class bye